nice, John, it's the 11th of June. I'm in Middlemarsh, near the pub The Hunter's Moon. And the other day I did notice some footpath signs. And I thought, well, I may as well try them. Um, I've, I've tried footpaths out this way before and been unlucky, but this, this looks like quite a good one here. Let's follow it along and see where it goes. Another one on this fence. It was a stinging mill. Ouch. Stung my neck now. Ah. Ooh, so nice. This is reassuring. A style. Makes me think I'm in the right place. The dog roses have started to come out. That's quite nice, these dog roses. Oh, yes, they are nice. This is like a double style, one each side of the hedge, and the hedge is quite thick. And the other side here, they've got um, a piece of the laid hedge, you know, going back years, uh, which actually forms the bottom part of the style. Rather nice touch. And then a bridge on the other side. Into a meadow. A big meadow, and it's uh, you know proper meadow. It's cultivated grass. It's rye grass. And so that last one I've just been through was just um, that weed grass. Uh, this is a path which I think we walked much, and. That's I can see the style over here. I haven't even got a map with me today because I've put it down somewhere and not quite sure where it is. I don't know. It's about like getting out. Be careful of the um, horse flies and things. Obviously a lot of money's been spent on these footpaths. Um, that one does say Dorset County Council, public footpath. I can smell wild garlic in the, in the woods here. Mm, huge great big pond. Oh. Water. Oh, there's something living in it. Something moved. This wild garlic is dying off now. Rather beautiful. Green and yellow. Opposite colour, well, opposite-ish, aren't they? I think it's orange that is actually the opposite of green, I'm not sure. I'd been looking for a footpath over here about six months ago. And then when I was driving along, I thought I saw a footpath sign in the field somewhere. And I think this is it, because what I've done, I've done a circular walk. So I'm nearly back at the road now. This is very picturesque. The um, big oak tree here. I have one tree that hasn't got any diseases yet. But they don't. There you go, everything's going to go, isn't it? And then, uh, the heat. It's like some sort of hanging platform for hanging men. There's the arrangement from the other side. Some sort of sheep thing, I think. Um, but there's no electric wire, so that's a relief. Now, one thing about Dorset, it's the sort of place where people come to um, sort of uh, have their own projects. Now, look at this. 
this is a lovely old farmhouse here and obviously a builder has bought it and I expect they're making some holiday cottages but it looks absolutely fantastic. This water is about six, well the, the drop to the water is about six feet. There's no guard. Get some Boy Scouts on it. And there's some of the, um, I mean get some Boy Scouts come out hiking at night and they fall in there. And there's some sort of dragonfly sort of things, the blue ones. Um, uh, I, I, don't, I don't know what they're called. I've just come back through the path. So there's the evidence. I am on the been on the footpath. Cool, you take your life in your hands coming down there though. No footpath on either side and no verge and um, it's on a corner so you if you're on the correct side of the road the cars can't see you so you've got to come round. I'm back at the Hunter's Moon pub. Quite picturesque. And the pubs that survived. That was a Norton Commando, the old style. Our pub, our pub in the village, it, um, the Gaggle of Geese, is uh, well, it's closed down at the moment. And we're not really sure whether it's ever going to reopen again. I'm on the home straight now. Father's Day book now for the 15th of June. Some things it's best not to comment at all. But there again, if you don't comment at all, I mean, that is a comment in itself, isn't it? Oh, looks like it's going to rain. Plums. Hmm. I'm back now for my little expedition. But, uh, I mean, you, there's no room for walkers anymore. You know, you just couldn't do it. <coughs> I mean, when, when I was a kid, in the Boy Scouts, we used to go do a lot of road walking on night hikes and hiking about the place and we'd always end up walking on the road. Well, you couldn't do it now. There's no footpaths, no verges. You'd get killed. Anyway, bye for now.